All right. Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Zach with Zach Reacts. Here to react to the Saints Row official story reveal trailer. I'm kind of excited for this. I'm, I want to get back into some Saints Row, man. The one that I recently played a little bit was Saints Row 4, but that one's trash. Everyone agrees. Um, I played some Saints Row 3, not much at all. Uh, Saints Row 2 is one of my favorite video games ever. I played the crap out of it. I hope they kind of pull back a bit and get back to their roots, which I think that's what they're doing. I'm excited for this. Let's go. React to this bullshit. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. How do we make a statement? We want to be more than a street gang. The graphics. We just got to be a little more creative. Last time we got creative, people tried to kill us. There it is. Realize that power. There's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. <laughs> the boss. Hey, the gameplay looks nice. There's somebody's nothing without me. And the boss of your life. There's no one I want more by my side than those guys. Life is full <laughs> of adversity and challenges. We took on two crews at once and walked away just fine. Guys, I was shot. Your friends deserve better. You really think you have what it takes to bring me in? You deserve better. But only you can choose to adapt to what life throws your way. You called for a ride? Good call. Let's get that money. That's dope. This looks really good. Um, We're starting a criminal empire. Generic story. And now it's time for us to reap the benefits. I come for your crown. <laughs> yeah, don't try to figure it out. <clears throat> yeah, point taken. We're really good at what we do. Um. Dang. We call ourselves the Saints. The gameplay's crazy. The gameplay's good. Um, I wish they would go back to some old characters, man. Like, where's, uh, what's that boy's name? Johnny? Johnny Gats or something? <clears throat> yeah, whatever. I know I'm gonna get some shit for that. Um, that looks alright. I don't really, I mean, the story's not too popular. In my opinion, it just feels like Saints Row kind of, like, changed identities a bit. Because it was always kind of flashy. It was always kind of, like, out there. That's, like, a big part of the game. But I don't know, man. It just doesn't feel like what it used to be. Because I kind of just liked the gang territory thing. We're still going to do that. But it's, like, I don't know. They, they try to make it much bigger than that. I, I liked the, you know, sort of the streets aspect of it. Maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. It just seems so, like... Sort of like Saints Row 4, like so dubstepy, which they didn't play no dubstep, but it just has that style to it, like that, uh, you know, that neon thing, you know, which that's not terrible, but it seems like a lot of games are doing that right now. It's pretty generic. I'm over it, you know, and I don't, I can't see how anybody else isn't. So, it's in my opinion, it looks okay. The gameplay is mainly what I like about this. It looks like a really fun game, so that's, let's, you know, let's get it, you know what I mean? Who doesn't play games that have fun? Let's, let's have some fun with it. So, yeah, I might check this out. I probably will. In fact, hmm. We changed our fries to make them hot and crispy oh, every single time. Hot fries. And every single time, Toby insists we high fry. Hot fry. Hot fry. Hot fry. It'll catch up. Whatever. Right? Try Wendy's hot and crispy fries. Preferred almost two to one over McDonald's. I know what it looks like. A brilliant plan gone off Let's the fucking so. rails. You think it's some pendejo messed up, and now all these poor bastardos are gonna choke on an all-you-can-eat buffet of bullet tacos. Well, I promise you, everything will work out exactly the way it's supposed to. Just keep your eyes and ears open. The next yep. few minutos could mean the difference between becoming Santo Eleso's numero uno crime boss 
Or just another notch in some punk stolen gun belt. So how does an up-and-coming gun for hire like you wind up in a hot mess like this? Let's rewind. You might not know it yet, but you and your friends are about to found an institution. The Saints. And if you want to be your own boss, you're gonna need to bust some heads. Um. First step on the journey is launching a startup. I mean, the fun kind. Illegal, criminal, and not exactly on the up and up. And it all happens here, in this southwestern paradise of Santo Ysidro. Try to keep up this time. He's like, I get it. Okay. This like, dusty jewel is a hot spot for striking it rich from the glittering high rises of Lakeshore right down to the dusty streets of Mercado and across the sprawling desert that guards our city like the angel of death. It's the ultimate sinner's playground, ripe with opportunity okay. to make a quick buck. But nothing comes for free. Yeah, the city looks Meet nice. The, the city looks really cool. Actually. In this corner, you've got Los Pantaros, Sergio's gang. They run a smuggling enterprise out of the Mercado and Barrio districts. They'll have no hesitations about okay. Getting okay, up in your business, so watch your back around there. That's pretty sick. And the other corner, the idols. Yeah. Now, these gatos are even more loco. I mean, just look at how they're dressed. These See? kids take homicidal See? anarchy to the See? EDM club. They don't sick. even have a leader. I don't know. It doesn't feel like the, the identity of Saints Row 1 and 2. So feels be different. Hot when you cross paths. And guess what? There's always another but I guess he can't be too much like GTA. His marshals take privatized defense technology to some mm. seriously mm. offensive it. levels. Just... Capture and control. I guess I just don't like it too much. You want to try your human luck against their advanced assets? Oh, you but can. The gameplay just don't underestimate him. Anyway, the I don't have to tell awesome. you this. Ain't that your former employers? <laughs> Way, way out in the desert, there is another wild bunch you might cross cacti with. All I'll say is if you do, bring your duct tape and cardboard. Okay. Uh I'm, <laughs> I'm... I'm just... I'm done. I can't do this no more. Alright. That's my reaction to Saints Row. You know, I'm kind of excited about the game, but... You know, what did Stubby say about Godfather? It, it insists upon itself. So, like, it, it, that's what this kind of does. Yes. So, yeah, I don't know. I mean... I really, I want it to be good because I want Saints Row to succeed. I like Saints Row, but it's sort of just like this thing where I think they just like, I don't know. It just seems like they're just like throwing a lot of stuff at you. It doesn't seem like they're actually like giving a shit. Mm, that's, I don't know, man. At least that's what I get from this. Like, I just hate this whole like. Ooh, look at me look at all the fun look at you know what i'm saying just like shit with some stuff why does it always have to be like this like bit like can we just watch something like am i tripping fine but i don't care that's some bullshit like let me just experience like the game for what it is not like what you want me to think the game is you know what i'm saying but that's just me might be tripping that's just me though but uh yeah, that's my reaction to all this. Um, thank you so much for watching my videos, or just this video, if you don't come back, which is fine. Um, like and subscribe and all that bullshit. And you have a great day. Bye.